short kick here. Fielded about the 17. And they're going to wind up with pretty good starting field position as they get it up past the 35. The Titans offense heading out, and it's probably an important season for the man under center, Marcus Mariota. This will be year number five since he was drafted second overall. And thus far, in terms of postseason success, just one wild card victory under his belt. Mariota and the Titans break the huddle first and 10 at their own 37. Working out of the gun, Mariota. Pass caught left side by Humphreys. And a six yard gain gets him right around the 43. A gain of six there on first. Six yards was the pickup on the last completion, so here's second and four. Now Mariota. That's complete, middle of the field to Humphreys. And he takes this one down almost all the way to the 30. The goal for any offense versus his own defense, find the holes where guys are available and put the ball on the receiver before any defender can step up and fill it. They did it well there, perfectly executed crossing route. Just a yard on the first down carry, so it's second and nine. They tried a quick hitter inside, but that one was swallowed up because what they were hoping, this big defensive lineman will take the bait and move laterally and open up a crease that they can run through. Didn't happen on that play. Mariota's throw on the money to Davis. Eight yards on the completion, but now they face third down. One thing we do know, he's going to get his catches. So as they move forward defensively, got to continue to focus on not giving up the big play when he does catch the ball in the second goal. And he will have the first down across the 20 to the 19-yard line. Just four yards on the pickup, but that's good enough to extend the drive. On third down, that's a good job of situational football and understanding where the first down marker was and getting there. They'll stay with Lewis here on first down. Lewis has the first down and then some. And into the end zone for a Tennessee touchdown. Scampering home from 19 yards out. And the Titans are an extra point away from tying this thing up. Oh, they get to the football. It's blocked. The Browns have it. It's a foot race. He's at the 50. He's at the 30. 20. And all the way into the end zone. And that's two points. Now it's Ryan Suckup on after the touchdown to kick it away. This will be fielded at the six. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here at the 30-yard line. And now Cleveland geared up to take the field. And they're hoping to redo their efforts in the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you have to go over and look at the tablet and see what you did on the last drive. When you scored points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. Now a throw right side taken in here to start this drive. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Browns touchdown. Robert Woods, two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Browns add on to their lead. I know Paul Revere talked about by land or by sea, right? And, you know, one by land, two by sea. He didn't mention air because right now we're seeing a big-time performance, aren't we? That's two touchdowns so far in this game. Where would you pull that one from? And, you know, every now and then I actually listened in history class. <laughs> and you're, you're just a scholar all the way around. You're reading all the time. I like that you fit that into the broadcast. <laughs> you know, I just grab a nugget when I can. Sanders on for the extra point. And his guys will take a 10-point lead. 